Where's Frieza? I said that too. <laughs> and one of these are spoilers for the movies if you haven't seen them. Uh, kind of late. <laughs> I don't care. You know, these are like movies from like the eighties. Not to mention any, like, I remember, like, when people, when the announcement came out on Crunchyroll, some people were like, I have them already. Like, well, good for you. You probably have the Mexican dub. I don't care. <laughs> right. A man is being brutally beaten in Siberia when Hyoga comes to the rescue. Follow up, following up on this man's mumblings about Asgard, the Saints of Athena head there to track down their colleague. However, the Battle of the Gods is approaching. As rebellion spreads throughout the Norse gods, can the saints defeat Dolbar and Loki, let alone a traitor in their mists? I don't know why they would want to beat up Dolan. <laughs> but they just don't like Dolan. Yeah, that one definitely the interesting one. I think it was. <clears throat> I don't know I kind of it kind of reminded me of the Broly movie, just on the grounds that like they were going someplace different, and it was like like in the midst of like. What seemed like the uh, beginning of like a big battle. So, I kind of liked it for its change of setting and whatnot. I don't know if anything from the movie carries over into the Asgard filler arc of the anime. Probably not. Yeah, actually, I hope not to. But, <clears throat> and of course, I guess we should. Eh, they said there was a traitor in the midst, but I guess we'll just leave that alone. Plus, if you've looked at the uh, DVD covers, you can kind of guess who it is. But it was Saya. Yeah, actually, Saya is pretty funny in this. Yeah, he has, he has a couple moments. Oh, Say Oh, Saya is a complete and utter dick bag. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's always been true.